Wow, where do we meet? <laughs> That's a fun story. <laughs> um, Florida State University. He dated all my friends, and two at one time, as a matter of fact. And then. She didn't actually say that. <laughs> <laughs> Um, she captured my heart though. He met my family and he really liked my family and the rest is history. They made me the, the best breakfast of my life and her mother was at the time the food editor uh, for the Daytona um, newspaper and that breakfast got me. That was, that was my hook. <laughs> Mom. Mom, he realized I was a good girl. Yeah, great family. <laughs> uh, we've been married 25 years and Natalie's 13 years old and Gabe's 10. So we basically had a life before the children. The best thing Gabe and I have ever done is have our children. Um, they're amazing. I was a video producer um, for over 10 years and worked corporate and was laid off actually in a merger and uh, went to um, an electric company to become a, a video producer. And then we were like, you know, there's, I think there's more to life than this, you know? and we had Natalie, and out of that um, grew, he was running health clubs at the time, and I, he said, Jill, I think I can get you home from work. Um, I think if I do a little personal training on the side, we can get you home from work. And what happened there was that we actually started a, um, a health and wellness company. It kind of morphed into that. It, start, it started personal training on the side when I was running health clubs, and then um, it just started to get bigger and bigger and bigger. Brought Jill home, and um, we were doing well um, prior to the to, to this recession. And um, we just hit rock bottom. We lost three six-figure contracts. Um, she was kind of managing. Yeah, I was working the back end of all this and trying to manage the contraction of the company, and having to scale back employees. And we were audited twice in that year. The the ship was was sinking. Uh, the house didn't really bother me, you know, uh, in, uh, you know, in the foreclosure. Uh, nothing really bothered me until first time in 25 years, she comes up to me and she actually was almost like this, tapped on my, on my shirt sleeve and she goes, just want to let you know, we're three months behind on our PDS. And that's Riverside Presbyterian Day School. That got my heart. That's where my children go to school. And that's when I kind of woke up. I says, you know what, I better do something. I literally, you've heard me say many times that we were praying for an answer. And we were trying to retool and we went up to Atlanta, Georgia. Um, Gabe was a keynote speaker. He had taken a speech course um, to try to generate some additional income for our company. After my keynote, complete stranger walks up to me and um, asked me if, if I ever heard of a product called ProTandem. And I'm telling you, God's my witness. I mean, if there wasn't eight to 10 people waiting in line to speak to me behind her, I would have turned around and walked away from her. I, I've never endorsed a product in the 30 plus years I've been in the fitness industry. And at that particular moment, ProTanum wasn't gonna be the first. But she asked me a simple question that literally has changed our lives. And that question was, would I be willing to watch a nine minute video on ABC Primetime News? I got back home to Jacksonville, watched it. The, the precise moment that Dr. McCord gives John Kenyonis his blood test results, I find myself doing something I've never done in my entire life. I actually found a way to buy something on the internet. Mm -hmm. And that's, that, that was the beginning. I went kicking and screaming to the meeting. I didn't want to, I knew it was network marketing. I didn't want to have anything to do with it. And within four hours in that meeting, we were all in and a vision was laid out, the company was just getting off the ground. I mean, we had every reason not to do it, really. And um, I like to share that because um, we're encountering a lot of people and, and a lot of negativity about network marketing and that stigma, but um, I was one of them. The very next day, I get a telephone call from Jason Domingo, he, and he says, I'm gonna be in Jacksonville. Um, on Thursday, this is like four or five days later. He goes, why don't you call a few of your friends and, uh, and, and I'll help you launch Jacksonville. I called 40 people is what I did. And I literally talked to them, no emails, picked up the phone. If I got a voicemail, call me, need to talk to you about something big. They, uh, 40, I talked to 40 people, 25 showed up. Today, 24 of the 25 were in the business 
as a, uh, a distributor or as a preferred customer. So that's how we launched our business. And I think everybody needs to do that, is just pick up the phone and, 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 and have you know, some ignorance on, you know, on fire and just have fun with it. And that's what we did. We had a, a, an incredible, incredible meeting and, and that's how we hit Pro 5 in 30 days. Everybody did what they were supposed to do. Gabe was shown the ABC primetime piece. Um, he was put on a three-way phone call. We had a coffee shop meeting, you know, everything. And then we had our first basically in-home meeting with about 25 people like five days later. And the rest is history. The whole East Coast is brought up. And our lives are completely changed. All we did was just follow this simplistic, duplicatable, perfected system called the Proven Plan. It's literally that simple. And it's amazing on how so many people just try to overcomplicate it. And it's really simple. When we're growing up, we learn about the pyramid of needs, right? And you know, at the bottom is you know food, clothing, and shelter. And that's where we were, you know, basically three years ago, or most of our 25 years at some level you know, and career-wise pushing hard and we make good money, but um, now we're able to help other people now. And our team has retired eight families and, you know, over 30 mommies. And to be able to actually shift that whole focus and go, you know, I'm just here to help you. And to approach people in that manner from the heart, it, it, it's it's like nothing you've ever experienced before in your entire life. And, and, and without this, opportunity we would have never ever experienced such an amazing thing i don't think i mean to be able to retire a family and give them those choices that we have now it's just a, it's an incredible feeling